Yeah, but then Chris was like, oh, I said CGTV, but Chris was like, oh, that's Dick Ryder. No, no, I actually agree with CGTV. I said that in my head too, but I didn't want to be the one that said it out loud. All right. Let's do a, se uh, let's do a segment while, you know what I'm saying? I right, get the camera. All right, boss, I'm ready for the jab. All right, this is the perfect shot. Just make sure that when you hit the glory hole, you make sure it sprays. What the hell are you talking? Are we? All right, let's start. I think we're doing the porno stuff. No, we're not. Bitch, what are you talking? No, man, we're doing the segment of, of. Just cover what's going on here. Okay, my bad. Hey guys, it's time for me if you want to come over and get involved. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. All right, no problem. You know, you gotta let us know when it goes right. out. Like three, Listen, two, one. We'll start here. Oh, okay. All right. I don't want to. I don't want to interrupt them while they're talking, because you know. Yeah, we get we're gonna loud. we're gonna talk here and then we'll move closer, okay? Yeah, okay, but I want to do the whole like you know the whole noise and everything, so I don't know what to do. All right, back here then. Is there like a is there like a stick like a boombox stick that I could do? Three, two, one. Oh, what, what, what is <laughs> that, man? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Sorry about that. Three, two, one. And here you have it. You are now tuned in to CGTV. My name is Mr. Zozo Baby, and I'm here live today at Sandy with Mr. Bones. As you can see, Mr. Bones right here, he's campaigning for chef, the chef department, and he's out here on these streets. War? The How the fuck do we look like we're going to war dashing? why he deserves to be chef and you know what quite frankly he deserves to be chef he's been touching the people tremendously for the past days he's been Pause. what you would know he's been what you would call it outside outside on these hoes you know what i mean he's been getting to know everybody getting to know what's going on in these streets and right now he is talking to the legion mc group here we have a blind man that needs help I'm not sure his name. He has NBC uh, on his chest. I think it was one of those old N NBC watch time crack. What? Oh, um, so as you can as you can see right now, let's get a little closer and see what Bones himself is talking about. Let's go. Yo, this guy said Bones is. Yo, Zoe, you gotta be careful with your words. You said this guy said Bones is touching people, man. Oh, hold on now. Hold on now. Touching I think the good. people. I think that's good. Good. It's good for Come right closer. We're gonna get a sneak peek okay. of what happens. Right, yes, sir. Hey, bring the camera over here. Hey, hey. <clears throat> hey, guys. Sorry to interrupt. Um, um. You know, it's uh, it's uh, it's Zozo from uh, CT uh, CG uh, TV. Um, we've got a few questions. Um, if you don't mind us asking, uh, Mr. Bones here. Absolutely. Yeah, go for it, man. It's a free area. Feel free. Hey, is the camera? Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right. All right. Hey, uh, Mr. Bones, we uh, we wanna uh, we wanna ask a few questions. We wanna know. Uh, Absolutely, says so. What are so you? We're not live. We're not live. We gotta go live. I gotta do the whole thing. <laughs> we're gonna do the whole thing, though. So. All right, three, two, okay. one. Oh. I, I did it again. <laughs> <laughs> These guys, bro. <clears throat> oh, sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Three, oh, two, okay. one. Oh, you're breaking your equipment. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go. Lock it. Lock it. Lock it. And we are back with another one. It's your boy Zozo with CGTV. We have live right now. We have the man himself, the man of the hour, the man of the day. The Yo, Hazek, thank you for that tier one, bro. Thank you so much. We have a few questions that people want to hear. Um, do you mind us asking a few questions, Mr. Bones? I would love it. I would love to hear your questions. Um. Mr. Bones, we wanna we wanna know what are you willing to do? Uh, what are you gonna be doing different from guys like Cornwood? Um, well, I'm not a politician. I think something that that Cornwood uh, kind of operates on is he's very political. Uh, oh my God, I we got a factor sub. We got a factor so sub for a long time, so I understand. Thank you, chat. You know, to Thank be you guys. reasonable and think logically before I make any split decisions. Mm. Uh, and I think that's something that really separates me from the pack from everybody else. Okay. You heard that, people. He understands what the people want. He's not a politician. He doesn't use politics to manipulate the people, okay? He cares for the people. That's what he's saying. Okay, another question. Uh, oh, hold uh, on. Can I ask a question real quick? 
Can I ask a question? Uh, sorry, we got a blind man interrupting. Hold on no, a second. Please, guys. Yes. And listen, man, I want to say I'm blind and homeless and shit. And I wanted to ask, like, if you became sheriff, you know, I, oh, what? What am I, am I facing the wrong way? Hey, no, I'll, I'll put the mic in your mouth here. Okay, put it in my mouth. Uh, all right, listen, man, go. so I just want to ask, once you become sheriff and shit, okay, are you going to help the people that have disabilities like me, bro? I'm selectively I, blind and shit, man. And, and I can't even afford to cure my... God. Oh, my God, he's curing my... I think he might be curing my blindness. What's going on? I'm, I'm just trying to make sure your glasses are on properly. I, th I think... Wait, you, wait, did he... Can you see, Mr. Blind Man? See? Oh, my God. Oh, oh my god! god. Are you, he just did a miracle! Yo, oh, it's a miracle, god. bro! I can see man. that! Oh! He can see, you can see! I can see that! like seeing for the first time in your life, Mr. Blind Man? Yo, dude, it feels like I, I couldn't see nothing, and now I can see. That's what it feels like. Your glasses, dude. Who who prescribed those to you? Were the, I Cornwall? don't know, man. I think Cornwood was the one that told me to put those glasses on, man. I think he the one that really? made me blind. <sighs> And you just cured it. I oh swear to God. God. You just needed oh to, those glasses God. were blackout glasses. It, they're, they're blind you. Yo, Bones is my sheriff, man. Bones oh is my, my sheriff. Gosh. And there you have it. Mr. Blind Man is cured. Okay, Mr. Bones, back to the regular questions. I want to yeah, uh, yeah. I want to ask you um do you, when when hire when hiring in this department, what type of um uh, you know, because the regular PD department seems like they hire any uh, Tim and Andy off the street. Uh, what kind of policies would you have and training would you have set for hiring people in this uh, department of yours? Uh, my entire department needs to agree on each and every hire uh, before I mm. even submit it to the state. Um, I think that's something that's different from the LSPD, whereas it's a couple, you know, a couple choices uh, that we get sent down from the chief or the ass chief, and they, they kind of just give us a list of people to interview. Uh, and we don't really have much say on it. I think if you involve your entire department, they kind of get brought up with that department, and that's very something special. Mm, yo, yeah. he's spitting right now, but he's spitting. that, guys. He's not gonna ha he's not gonna hire er any Tim Tim Buck and Andy. He's gonna be doing proper filters in the and making sure that uh, these officers are are proper and up to par. Um, another question, mm. sir. Can I interject uh, a little bit on that? Oh yeah, sure, Cassidy. Here, here we go. I uh, appreciate it. Uh, Introduce yourself, also... Cassidy. Uh, I'm Leon Cassidy. I'm running as under sheriff, the uh, sheriff Bones. Mm -hmm. uh, I just wanted to add that uh, a lot of people are worried that the uh, BCSO might turn into just the <laughs> LSPD too. Uh, me and Bones don't have any ideas to just strip the LSPD and bring 25, 30 people over and just call it the BCSO. We want to bring a handful of people that are willing and wanting and desire to build a department from the ground up. And then we want to work from there, get our own P&T system going, and then get, get our hires. And there you have it. He wants to mold the apartment in the right, correct way and not just grab any and anybody from the PD department. Okay, I like that. Um, another question, Bones, I would have for you. How do you feel about extending warrants? Mm. Um, mm. So the extending warrants comes through the DOJ. Um, you have to have proper reasoning well, why you're extending that warrant and submitting it. Um, but... That's not, that's inherently just a question for them. I think if, if cops aren't really giving the warrant the time of day or they're not even trying to go after the person or do search parties for them, then it should not be extended, in my opinion. Okay. That's and right. Also, how do that's you feel right. about uh, that's my turbo sheriff. charges in uh, the state of PD um, going a little crazy for just getting turbos right now? That's my uh, sheriff. I think the turbo charges are, are fine. I think charges in general for stealing goods is, is fine. Uh, but you shouldn't change how you uh, operate as a police department just because of mm -hmm. uh, you lose some material. Uh, mm. like it's at the end of the day, it's 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 a turbo. It's not a life. Mm, and he's how do you it. feel about illegal searches and uh, you know, not to mention any names? Cornwood saying uh, I'm gonna illegally search you and uh, I'll take that. I'll take sue me, sue me, sue me, and go to court. How do you feel about that, sir? Uh, I don't like that at all. Uh, I think I think that is the like the the problem. I think if you are going, ev everything should be in good faith, right? And if they're purposely doing it in bad faith, that's when you would you know kind of reconsider on what they're doing as a police officer and what their intentions truly are as a cop. Mm. Okay. All right. And last uh, last question. Um, what is your thoughts on uh, Conan Clarkson? Uh, he needs to be. I guess 
he he needs to stop instigating. I think that's that's his only flaw. I think he's a great leader, <laughs> great person. He just needs to stop instigating. I don't want cops out there instigating with different gangs, starting shootouts, and putting <laughs> people you know at risk. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, and I have one more question, right? Um, you know these fine people out here on Sandy, the bikers, uh, Legion, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. What are you willing to, uh? offer them as far as safety and um you know they they have a good setup here and i guess not causing chaos in their in their chaos mm -hmm. uh listen i it is going to be an open door policy for them to talk and communicate with us as as often as they want i can promise them that they'll have the respect that that they're looking for from the police department um and I'll, as it's a two-way street i think i think a lot of cops demand respect but they're not really giving that respect out and and that's very important Okay, okay. I, and there you have question. Oh, 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 our, our Sir, cameraman this is, has a question. Uh, we, we were getting calls mm -hmm. in right now, Mr. Bones. We're getting calls in over the line. Uh, mm -hmm. You are single, is that correct? Um, oh, God. No. Well, who cares? Anyway, they all want to know how big is it. Could you roll? Uh, yep, he's asking the hard questions, man. I mean, somebody, you know, somebody has to ask You know them. why they call me Bones, right? Oh, we got to find out, sir. It's I think my last name, but you know what? Watching wants to see. Well, ladies and gentlemen, he Damn. just put out his car. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right. And there you have it, guys. <clears throat> we just had a great interview with Mr. Bones and Cassidy <laughs> himself, your reporter Zozo with CGTV. And we'll be live back with another one. Take care. That's right. Hell yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you for your time. Hey, thank you guys Appreciate for your time, it. man. That was a good yeah. segment. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Keep right. it up, Appreciate guys. You guys. Yep, yep. Later. You guys have a good one. Yeah, you too. You too. Uh, you can see none. Okay. All right. Okay. That was that was a firearm. That was a firearm. Oh, I didn't see any. 